Contour Generation with Break Lines Hello everyone, welcome to video tutorial on how to generate contour with break lines. When generating contours, normally point data and boundary are required. However, sometimes while generating contours, we need to clearly indicate the software to distinguish data. For example, if a river survey is done and if we generate the contours considering all the values, then it is likely that we get wrong contours as software considers levels in the ground and river surface together for making the triangulation. And hence, contours which get generated will consider all the levels for creating the surface and hence the surface will appear undesirably. With the break lines concept, we can indicate the software that it has to distinguish separate data, say data within river edges and the remaining ground data. By doing so, the contours that get generated will represent properly by contours. In eSurvey CAD, to generate contours with break lines, you just need to create proper break lines as 3D polyline and just keep it in break line layer. The software will automatically consider all the lines in break line layer and generate contours. On application of break lines, the software will not allow the triangulation to cross over the break lines. Thus, a desired surface is created. If you want to see the triangulation, you can switch on the 3D surface option while generating contour. This is how you can generate contours with break line within a CAD package. If your requirement is to generate contours within the eSurvey CAD interface, then you can export break lines from CAD using menu item Export Break Lines from the Contours submenu on eSurvey CAD menu. Then, you can import the break lines in eSurvey CAD under Surface option. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. You will learn how to create 3D representation of contour map using eSurvey CAD. 